Octomom and her famous offspring are jumping for joy. We're 10! The octuplets are turning 10. Inside Edition is invited to their birthday party at Circus Tricks OC. I'm Noah. I'm Aaliyah. I'm Isaiah. I'm Naraya. I'm Jonah. I'm Jeremiah. I'm Josiah. I'm Akai. The celebration is a wild balance of happy chaos just like life at home. There you go. Natalie Suleiman has her hands full. In addition to her octuplets, Natalie is raising six older children. In total, 14 kids. Yes, we are struggling. Yes, we are in financial hardship. But she says her children are her greatest joy. I couldn't even imagine what I'd do without my kids. They're literal angels. They live in a small three-bedroom home outside Los Angeles. Space is so tight, some kids sleep on the couch. The siblings spend time quizzing each other in math. How about five times 20? 100. They also practice musical instruments. Each child is assigned a chore. I love to cook. Naraya does the cooking. The family is vegan. Today, she prepares lentil soup. It's really, really, really good. Noah and Malia do laundry. With 14 kids in the house, that's a lot of clothes to wash and fold. My job is to do dishes. Jonah cleans dishes. Jeremiah is in charge of drying. There are other chores, like wiping down appliances, setting the table, and vacuuming. They are incredibly supportive. I don't even know what I'd do without my kids. 10 years ago, Octomom's pregnancy shocked the world. The most controversial mom in America is finally speaking out. She was roundly criticized for being irresponsible. How could a single mom raise so many kids? When I visited Natalie in 2012, her house was a mess. Walls were punched in and defaced. You see, you see all this stuff and, and, and you well, worry. This is paint, we're painting everything. Now, with her kids happy and healthy, she hopes she's proven her critics wrong. Now that 10 years has gone by, I feel as though I can relax and be myself and be real. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, guys.